Hi everyone, I would like to present a Stirling engine uh, that I made. Uh, I was constructing it for <coughs> the previous four months and I would like to start with a list of persons who helped me and who contributed in this uh, engine. First is Alexander who gave me this piece of metal from bicycle wheels. Also for Ahmed who gave me this LCD disc. Also for my Kum Oleg who gave me this alcohol. And uh, a person who encouraged me, uh, Dmitry, he's actually, as I said, encouraged me to, to do it. I saw his video on YouTube. And uh, another special thanks for my girlfriend Sabine for allowing me building this engine on the kitchen table while she was making some food over there. So thanks for her and for everyone once more. Now I will put a video on pause and uh, we'll make preparation here. So. So this is um, why alcohol was needed to make fire and still engine can't work without source of, uh, of heat. Um, so I will put the engine on top of these things. Um, fire hits an area somewhere there and the magic happened and it starts our tube start to rotate, but just wait it to hit a bit. Well, yeah, it works. So, um, the speed is really slow. Uh, a torque is also not very big, actually. I can stop it easily with finger. Uh, the the biggest problem that I have so far is the problem with this cylinder. Um, actually, you, you can't see, but uh, um, it works really not very smooth, and it's hard to rotate this cylinder itself. Uh, I actually will stop it for a moment. I want to show you how it works without the cylinder that I think um, works uh, for the bed. I will just put it on the, with one cylinder here. Yeah. So with only one cylinder that works smooth, it works pretty fast. And I really enjoy how it works with only one cylinder. Uh, with two, it's a bit noisy and, and not so fast. And even even torque itself are less with uh, two cylinders than with one. So what uh, can here? So it's basically all that I want to to share. And um, thanks once more for everyone who helped me, and see you around. Bye-bye.